Hello everybody and welcome back to the channel. It's your friendly neighborhood of Farmer Raznak and it's time to find some collectibles. That's right. We are back on a brand new map, Old Stream of Farms by Black Sheep Modding. This is a beauty of a map. The beauty of the map. Definitely worth checking out. This has, it's, it's just really nice and, and quaint. It's a great for single player, also some multiplayer options. But everything is beautiful it just it feels old there's just textures everywhere it's great it's great but we're not here for a map review folks that's right we're here to find the collectibles and what's even better is this is the first map in the mod hub that has custom collectibles that's right you have custom collectibles black sheep modding has hidden wouldn't you be surprised Little black sheep. Yes, 10 little black sheep have been hidden all around the land for us to find. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to find them. It's not very hard. There is a couple of them that might be a little tricky. He hides some of them very, very well. Uh, so yeah, let's get to it. The very first one, you're going to go right out the front gate from spawn. And you're going to walk in this general direction, which is east or west and kind of a little south until you get over here to the intersection. And right here where the intersection, you got biogas plant, Larson, the grain elevator. There's a little intersection here, right over here on this back side of the intersection, you will find our first black sheep. Isn't he cute? He's so cute. I love him. This is uh, number one at 1158, 874. That's black sheep number one, 1158, 874. We'll go ahead and pick him up. Oop, and you get $80,000, and it tells you there are nine more sheep to find. Let's go find the next one. Sheep number two is a really, really easy to find. The best thing to do is fast travel here to the bakery. You fast travel right here to the bakery, and then what you're going to do is you're going to go kind of around the back of the bakery, again, heading west from the bakery. See, you got like a little no-way street. What you're going to find is your little playground, okay? So the bakery's over there, playground's over here, and up on top of the slide, just waiting for his turn to play, is Black Sheep number two. At 891, 923, we have Black Sheep number two. We will grab him up, and let's head on to the next one. Our next sheep is Sheep number three. Black Sheep number three is hiding next to a wood pile here. We are here next to field 27 down in the there's like a bend in the river here i'll pull up the big map so you can see where we're at here is the bakery south of the bakery field 27 right here in the bend of the river you'll find this wood pile just hanging out right here next to this beautifully decorated just old oh, i love this place i love it you will find our next little sheep so we'll go ahead and pick up this little sheep this is at 9 40 11, 18, 9, 40, 11, 18. Oop, and we have seven sheeps to go. This next one is, is probably going to be the hardest one to find for people who don't use commands like collectible, GS collectible show all, or people who don't use, you know, it, it's just going to be a hard one to find. So a lot of people who don't have the ability to make this easier or to cheat, as we like to say, uh, this one is going to be a little bit harder to find. I'll show you and the main map where we're looking at. Right here is field 42 in field 43. And in this brush line, you're going to see... Uh, I'm just going to try to give you it. You've got, like, two birch trees right here. And then just kind of look for these two birch trees right here in the corner of 42 and 43. And then right up in here, and it's really hard to find... Hidden right there, you will find one of the sheep. It's it's kind of it's it's almost like it fell off the tractor and got left here many many years ago, and the poor sheep's been all alone with the the hedgerow growing around it. But this is sheep number four at six ninety uh, six ninety one zero zero eight six ninety one zero zero eight. You will find black sheep number four. Boop, got six to go. The next sheep on our list will be found at the biomass heating plant on the map. Right here is the biomass heating plant. There's a biomass heating plant. There's a debris crusher. There's a lime station. 
right here, you're going to fast travel down to the biomass heating plant. And behind the biomass heating plant, you're going to see all these dump bins. Like right there's a debris crusher where you can bring your rock. We got junk. And some, somebody, it's, it's so sad. One of these, I can't remember which one. There it is. It's one of the ladder. It's the one with the ladder. Look for the ladder. The one with the ladder. Someone threw this poor little sheepy away. He's so sad and all by himself. Feel bad for him. All right, let's get him. This is the next one. 11, 16, 12, 45. Again, behind the biomass heating plant in the dumpster with the ladder. You will find our fifth sheep. And boop. There we go. Another $80,000. The next two are really, really close together. You'll find them very close to the horse farm. There actually is a horse farm on the map, a horse pasture, a horse farm, whatever you want to call it. Uh, this is actually a buyable area right here, $62,000. If you buy it, you can get horses and there's like a pasture and all that stuff you can use for them. So the easiest way to get to that would be to fast travel right here to the farmer's market, right here at the farmer's market. And then you're gonna walk across the street to the horse barn. Now, you can't open this gate unless you own the land. Once you own the land, you can open the gate. You can just jump over it. But let me show you, I'm not lying, if I buy this. You said, I thought you could open this. There it goes. Okay. Now I can open the gate. I couldn't open the gate unless I had bought the land. But you could always just jump over the wall. You don't have to buy the land to get the collectible. But over here, in one of the horse stalls, you are going to find our next little sheepy. He's in this first little horse stall right here. Right here in... And he's just sitting here, all scared, all by himself. He just needs you to collect him. This is next sheep, 1448-11-23. Oop, that is sheep number six. 1448 11 23. The next one isn't very far from here. We're just going to kind of walk again east and a little south to this structure here. Uh, I'm sorry. Gotta remember how to get in. Yeah, around this way. So it, I think this is still part of the property that you owned. Oop, wrong button. It's, it's uh, just outside of the horse property. But you're going to find. Uh, this place again just kind of south and east from the horse area you're gonna find this really cool looking residence uh, it's just kind of neat you're gonna walk in the gate you're gonna see this white car i don't know why they have all these trash cans but they do and you're going to find our next little sheep sheepy number seven at 1486 11 57 let's snatch him up Oop. and we are almost done our next sheep, I think we got, how many we got? One, two, we got three left to go. So we got three sheeps to go, three more. Uh, this sheep is easy to find. You're gonna fast travel to the great processing unit. There's actually a great processing unit at Spinnery, but you can fast travel to the great, great processing unit and you're actually going to be looking in the right direction. Right in front of you, you see that red ladder? That red ladder right here where this house is across the street from the great processing unit. You wanna go to the bottom of that ladder and waiting for his moment to get up on the roof and see the world from behind these walls, you will find sheep number, what is this, seven, eight? I don't know. One of the sheeps, you'll find him. This is at 1574, 10, 11, 1574, 10, 11. Boop, we'll grab him up. That was sheep number eight. We've got two more to go. This next one might be another one that's really, it's really well hidden. It's a very kind of, it's kind of blends into the environment really well. It's hard to see, but the easiest way to find our next sheep is to fast travel to the dairy. We'll hit visit and we'll kind of spawn in here next to the dairy. Very nice buildings in this map. I'm telling you, this map, beautiful. Some of the textures are maybe a need a little bit of update, but I mean, all in all, this, this is a great map. Um, but yeah, what you're going to do is you're going to go away from the dairy, kind of up the road here, up the sidewalk. And on your right, you're going to find a wall, jump over it, and do that man's walking. You're going to see this old fountain. And look here, standing next to the old fountain. I'm sorry. Sorry, don't. Looking for sheep, bro. Still, uh, you're going to find a fountain without water. And right there, that's a joke for those who know about it. Um... And then right next to the fountain, 
you are going to find sheep number nine, 1591, 869. Like I said, it blends in very well. Like if you're not looking specifically back here or if you're kind of like walking by, it just blends in very well. So it might be a hard one to find. 1591, 868. Boop. And we have one sheep to go. Our last sheep is really, really easy to come by. You just fast travel up here to the J GCHB grain elevator, 18, 19, 16, 17, 18, up here in the very north part, northeastern part of the map. What we're going to do is we're going to fast travel there, and it's going to put you right here on this loading ramp. Right next to the loading ramp, you're going to go up it, look to your left, and there is our last sheep. Easy as could be, all of them have been found. This last sheep is at 1652, 360. This is sheep number 10. We're gonna go ahead and grab that, and then I'm gonna show you something really, really cool. So let's go ahead and grab that up. Boop. You found it, and we get a $200,000 bonus. You have found 10 sheep. Go to Cody's Toy Store. Maybe something has changed. So let's look at finances just real quick. A million dollars. That's a million dollars. If you find all 10 sheep, you get one million extra dollars to start with. It won't take but a matter of minutes. You can do that very, very quickly. Uh, if you don't have a way to cheat in money or add money, it's a really nice little touch. Plus, it gives you an opportunity to go see the sights and sounds of the map. The map has tons and tons of just useful storage. There's all kinds of buildings that you can use all over the map. It's really worth exploring. Definitely worth checking out and uh, a great, great new map. Uh, a, a new map brought in forward because uh, this map has been around but I, I think it's been brought forward to FS22 very very well all right I'm gonna go show you something special so unlike Calmsden Calmsden when I did the map collectibles if you remember right once you found them they kind of randomly spawned around the yard uh, as, as kind of a decorative feature that was there after you found them uh, this map was a little bit different I actually like this I like what they did here really, really well. Uh, right here at the vehicle shop. Uh, right here. Vehicle shop. Right there. Vehicle shop. Uh, where all your stuff spawns in, where you can buy your tractors, everything. If you go inside of this vehicle shop, there are two really, really cool surprises. The first surprise, which I'll show you that has nothing to do with collectibles, is you have raisable platforms. So just, just a little bonus to this video. You can raise both these platforms up. You can bring your vehicles in, raise them up, and kind of role play and have fun with that kind of stuff. But over here behind the counter, you're going to see Cody's store, right? It's Cody's Shroar. <laughs> That's that, yeah, Cody's Shroar. Uh, but this, you're going to see some stuff that will spawn in right here. And in fact, through the magic of YouTube, let's make that happen. I'm just going to snap my fingers. And magically, we have all of our little sheeps collected on a nice little shelf, plus a big, giant golden sheep. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And that is what happens when you collect all of the sheep. They all show up right here in Cody's Shroar. <laughs> Just Shroar. All right. So that is the that that's all the collectibles, folks, for Old Stream Farm. I, I hope I hope you really really enjoyed this video i hope it helped you find what you're looking for if it did give me a thumbs up you know throw me a comment in there tell me how much you liked it share it with your friends tell them uh, but in the meantime if you get a chance please please download old stream farms by black sheep modding it's a beautiful map beautiful map uh great gonna be great single player map especially if you like you know medium to small size equipment i mean you're not gonna be using big big stuff here uh it's it's a very nice map definitely we're checking out the it's it's just it's just so pretty just so pretty um i mean i must have did i turn i must have turned i thought i had oh i had i had flight mode already on oops but i mean we'll just we'll just kind of fly up in there and you can just see the map edge is so well done that highway is the map edge this over here is non-playable land yet Yet, I mean, I have a feeling that this map could be expandable if, if Black Sheep wants to expand it. But, I mean, the map edge is so well done. There's just all these little beautiful water features. The town is nice. You have all these buildings. Like, this doesn't... Look, that's usable. 
This building is usable. What? There's all kinds of buildings that you can use all around the map. Um, that in the past just weren't there like this little right here come down here. Look at this. You can open this You can put stuff in this building. It's not even part of the main farm There's all kinds of buildings like that all around the map along with the fun custom collectibles, which was a great addition By black sheep money. I think they really really captured the collectibles and made it their own on this one um, So congratulations to them make sure you download the map give them uh, the best review that you believe they deserve and until next time, stay safe. Thanks for watching. See you later. Bye-bye. Say bye, sheepies.